people often ask uh, this question, that is, um, there's so many types of Buddhism, if I become interested in Buddhism, which type should I choose? And indeed, which is the best type? Well, I always use the analogy of a river. If you go to the source of a river, and then you go to where the river falls into the sea, they look very, very different. You would think that they're not the same thing. But if you go to the source and you follow the river as it goes through the hills and the dales and other rivers flow into it and it goes over waterfalls and it meanders this way and that way, when you got to the delta of the river, you'd understand why it looks different. The, the, the things that made it different. And then you would see that in actual fact it's still the same river. Now I would say that it's exactly the same with Buddhism. If you're interested in the Dhamma, start at the beginning, at the source, at the earliest text, the earliest thing, which is basically the Four Noble Truths and the Eightfold Path. And then, after you get a good foundation in that, move on and look at later schools and later developments and what have you. And then, after you've done that, you would understand that it's impossible to say that this Buddhism is better than that Buddhism, or that this Buddhism is inferior and that is superior. It's all a part of the same um, wisdom of the Buddha, and therefore it is all legitimate.